welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian and today, as you guys can see from the title, it is going to be a Target's Dollar Spot Valentine's Shop With Me. So I did film a intro while I was in the car when I was outside of Target in the parking lot, but I'm not sure what happened to the sound of that video because I went to edit this video and I still have the video, but for some reason the sound is completely muted and I tried to get the sound up and I don't know what happened to it. This has happened before where I filmed a clip and then there was like no sound. I'm not sure why that happens, but I had to refilm this intro. So that is why I am home filming the intro. So the first half of this video is going to be me at my local Target showing you guys what they have out right now as far as Valentine's stuff in the dollar spot. And then the last part of the video will be a very small haul of what I picked up while I was there. It's literally only a handful of items, but I thought I would still share with you guys what I picked up. So let's go ahead and jump in to the shop with me part and then I will come back here and show you guys what I purchased. If you guys are interested in just seeing what I purchased, I will try to remember to put a timestamp here um, where I show you guys what I got, but let's go ahead and jump in to the shop with me part of this video. All right, you guys, so I'm doing a voiceover because I think it's always super awkward when I'm trying to talk to you guys in store while filming. But when I first walked in, these are the first few things that I saw. As you guys saw, those two really cute baskets. They also had these packs. They came with three in each, and there were a few different designs with a bunch of different sayings that were really cute. And I think they were only $3.00. They also had these one said wash and dry. This other one said flush and wash. I think that's really cute for like a guest bathroom or maybe the kids bathroom. And those are $3 a piece. This is really cute for your laundry room. Lost socks because who doesn't lose socks? And then also keys. I have a little hook that I hang up my keys. So I didn't get any of that. But I thought that was really cute. And of course, they always have candles. I always feel like their candles really don't have much of a scent. So I never buy them, but they are cute. I also found some books. I think these are the only two books that I saw, but I've never seen books like these in the dollar spot. Maybe it's just my target, but I did find those two. And then I was super tempted to get this Be Our Guest little wooden frame. I didn't get it, but I think that was really cute. And they also had one or two other sayings. This one is perfect for obviously a bathroom. Again, really cute in the guest bathroom or a kid's bathroom. They had some pillows. I might go back and get these. I think it'll be really cute for spring. I didn't pick it up this time around, but they were cute and they had tassels on it and they were $5 a piece. And then of course, kitchen towels. They always have kitchen towels. They have some packs that come with two kitchen towels and then another pack that comes with the pot warmer and then one kitchen towel. Also, I think these dishes are really cute to like maybe put in your kitchen and put a few little pieces of candy in there. Of course, if you have kids, they'll probably be gone within the same day that you put the candy in, but I think that's really cute. Also, banners. Sometimes I buy these banners and I hang it up right in front of like my fireplace or over my fireplace. This time around, I didn't pick any up, but those are really cute as well. I also really loved these tins. Something I also might go back for. I just didn't want to go crazy grabbing things because a lot of times I grab a ton of things and then I have nowhere to put them and I don't ever use them. But I thought those are really cute. And then here are some more towels for your kitchen. And these are a pack of two kitchen towels and they were $5 for each pack. And then they had really cute wreaths. I'm about to show you guys in a second. They had one heart one and another one that was an XO. I grabbed both of them because I thought they were so cute and they were both $5 a piece. So I really liked the color of these measuring spoons. They also had a little whisk and I think also a like little cake scooper or cake spatula. Those are the only ones I saw. They had some organizing bins. If you guys are trying to organize your house, they had these bins. They also had, I think, clear ones. They had a few different options and also sizes to choose from. They did range in prices. Some of the organizing bins were three and then some were five. So it just depends which ones you got. They also had a bunch of spring flowers. So this is like a combination of spring items and also Valentine's. I can't wait until they start pulling out more spring stuff. I'll probably go crazy, but for now they are just sprinkling in like a little 
little bit of spring and then valentine's so i love faux plants do you guys i love buying these little plants these were kind of too small for me to put in my house i feel like i don't have an area to put them in but they were really cute and then they have these wreaths. I like to use these, like to put in the center of a table and then put like a candle in the middle of it. But you can also do like a bunch of DIYs with that as well. That was really cute. And then they had a, a few different um, rocks. They had pink ones, they had white ones in different sizes. So they have a lot of really cute things. Also, if you guys are traveling anytime soon, I know a lot of us don't feel safe enough to travel, but they did have a lot of like travel sized items and stuff to keep your stuff organized. I also found these cleaning clothes cloths they came in a pack of three and just a bunch of like random knickknacks i thought would just go ahead and throw in and share with you guys so i can find my own and these were a bunch more travel size items I want to share with you guys. You guys don't have to use these, obviously, to travel. Maybe if you go to the gym, you can bring that to the gym with you. Um, if you guys stay over a family member's house, bring that over to their house as well. So you can use it for other things. This was a pack of two. I think that was three or five dollars and it was two different sizes. And then these are some more organizing bins. Like I said, they had a bunch of different organizing bins. Some were metal, some were plastic, and then they had a bunch of different sizes and all the organizing stuff. And then this is just more bags to store stuff and travel with. They had some pen little bags, these little ones. It came, I think, in three or four different colors and designs. Some of them had sayings on it. Some of them just had a cute little picture. And then some were more simple, like the one I just showed you guys. And then of course they have a ton of like notebooks and stuff to stay organized for the new year and calendars. I got myself notebooks. I like to write things down in a notebook for what I want to do for that week or month just to stay a little more organized. They also had these that you can like put in your kitchen and it had a marker that came with it. They had the black one that was like a chalk one and then they had this one that was clear I thought was really cute as well. And here are some more candles they had. They had a ton of candles out. I don't think I've ever seen my Target with this many candles in the dollar spot. They had like a whole section of candles. But like I said, I actually don't pick them up because I don't feel like they have a good scent to it or a scent throw to it. So that's why I don't pick it up. But I also found these mask little containers you can store your masks in. They had two different ones to choose from that. And then also some tissues. They also had these reusable cups. I've never seen that before. I thought that was pretty cool. And then these of you guys have little ones. You have a stroller. This is perfect to put on their stroller or maybe to help you bring in groceries. You can put all your groceries in there and bring it in. So yeah, I'm just going to pop in here and there and talk to you guys. But as you guys can see, they have a lot of random knickknacks like they always do. you have little ones definitely check out the dollar spot they have a lot of stuff that would go perfect maybe in their bedroom bathroom or if they have a playroom or maybe if you even homeschool i think all this stuff would go perfect in all of those areas Where is your heart? Just so I can find my own. Help me, baby. 
getting into more valentine stuff so they had these gel window clings that are really fun for kids it is a better deal if you get them from the dollar tree just because you get more in a pack but that's really cute only for a dollar and then of course they always have fun festive socks for each season and these are so cute i got some for the kids they're only a dollar a piece some were fuzzy and then just some were regular socks and then of course they have like party favors either if you guys are having like a little get together for valentine's or if your kids are going to school and they are exchanging valentine's cards they have a ton to choose from <laughs> And while we're stuck here falling, there's water out there calling I've been building my own ship to sail away and We'll wait for the sun when you've got flowers in your hands You pick the petals one by one just to find out where you stand You've been running from the smoke, you've been caught up by the flame Falling at first through the dark, and everything just seems to change that was my shopping part of this video so now i'm going to show you guys what i picked up like i said it's only a few things but i figured i would still throw that in to today's video so the first two things i got were these two planters and these were three dollars each which i think is a really great deal so i got this white colored one and then i also got this gray colored one now i'm not sure where i'm going to put these i'm not sure if i'm going to put real flowers or faux flowers not sure, but I just thought for $3, it was a really good deal. So I grabbed two of these. I also picked up this basket and this basket was $5. Again, with this one, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it, but I thought it was really cute. So I just picked up one and then I will see where I put it. And if I wanna pick up another one, I will go back and grab another one. But for now, I just grabbed one. So the next item is going to be some Valentine's towels. And for some reason, I feel like they used to be $3 for the pack and now they are five. I might be mistaken, but this was $5 for a set of two. And I just got this color because it's just a neutral color that'll go perfect in my kitchen. So this first one here has a few little tassels in the bottom and they are like a very light gray with gray stripes. And then the second one is white with a bunch of gray hearts. I thought that was really cute to put in my kitchen. And then talking about Valentine's, I do usually give my kids something a very small for Valentine's. Usually just maybe a balloon, candy, a teddy bear or something. So I found these and I thought they were really cute. They were both a dollar. So I got these for my daughter, Madison. It just has a bunch of the candy hearts all over it. And then I got this one for my son. You guys know he's obsessed with dinosaurs. And this was also a dollar and has a bunch of Valentine's red hearts and dinosaurs. So I grabbed those two to give my kids for Valentine's. I also found this really cute um, wreath. 
and it's just a heart with some flowers. This was $5 and I thought this would go cute hanging in front of my pantry door. So that's why I plan on putting this, but I thought that was really cute. And then I also picked up this one and it's just an XO little wreath. And I like that it comes with this like little burlap string so you can hang it up or you can just prop it up somewhere. So I'm not sure where I'm gonna put this, but this was also $5 and I thought that was really cute. It has some red little, um, I don't even know what these are called, red little details right here with also some baby pink ones. So I grabbed this one as well. I also picked up these two thank you cards just because I am starting to sell on Poshmark and then I'm also going to be opening up an Etsy shop. So I figured these cards would be really cute to throw in those bags whenever I ship things out. If you guys are interested in following me over on Poshmark and see what I am selling, then I will leave it linked down below. But these were only a dollar for a pack of eight. So I grabbed two packs of those. I also grabbed this travel bottle kit and it comes with three and I just thought the colors are really, really pretty. It was only $3. I have no clue when the next time is that we will be traveling, but I just thought this would be really good just to have on hand. And then the last item I got from the dollar spot was this notebook. This notebook was $3, which I think is a really great deal because it's a pretty good size. I already started um, writing in it, but in the front it says, enjoy the journey. And then in the back, it has a bunch of these really pretty leaves and then inside it just has a bunch of plain white paper and then it says notes and you can jot whatever you would like down in there so I just thought this was really cute to keep me organized and the last thing I picked up was not from the dollar spot but I still wanted to show you guys because it was on clearance it was 50% off I think I got it for like 11 or 12 dollars and it is just this really pretty runner. So I feel like this would go really pretty on my new dining room table. It has a bunch of really bright um, lemons and it has some tassels right here. It's just a little table runner by Opal House. And I'm gonna put this out for springtime. So we'll see how that turns out on my dining room table. But this was the last item that I picked up from Target. All right, friends, so that is going to end my Target's Valentine's Dollar Spot Shop with me and also mini haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I've been focusing more on like cleaning and organizing style videos here on my channel. But I did mention that every once in a while, like once or twice a month that I would throw in either a shopping style video or a vlog. So today was a shop with me. So like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please remember to give my video a thumbs up and also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you have not already. I would love for you to be a part of my YouTube family. Love you guys, stay safe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.